Here's a review of a scene from the 1987 war drama movie, Full Metal Jacket. Written, directed, and produced by the late Stanley Kubrick as his 12th movie, and starring Matthew Modine, Vincent D'Onofrio, and the late Arlie Ermey, despite the fact that this part of the movie takes place on Paris Island, South Carolina. Paris Island, South Carolina, the United States Marine Corps Recruit Depot. The entire boot camp phase of the movie actually takes place in the Bassingbourne Barracks, a British army base in Cambridge, England. The movie is narrated by Modine's character known as Joker. Private Joker! Private Joker! Private Joker! And features his life as he goes through boot camp and in the Vietnam War in the United States Marine Corps. Right off the bat, the audience is introduced to the movie's most iconic character, drill instructor Hartman. I am Gunnery Sergeant Hartman, your senior drill instructor. And the viewers can see how the director uses the camera to follow the drill instructor around while showing as much of the barracks and the platoon as possible, which makes it clear that at this moment, Hartman is the center of this movie's universe. You are pukes. You are the lowest form of life on earth. You are not even human fucking beings. You are nothing but unorganized, grabastic pieces of amphibian shit. At first, Hubert hired Arlie Ermey as a consultant for the movie and actually didn't want to give him the role of Hartman because he thought Ermey wasn't vicious enough for the role after seeing his performance in The Boys from Company C. I want you to do a special job on Jesus for me there, huh? Real good there for me. I want to see Jesus ball there. Of course, that changed after seeing Ermey improvise insulting dialogue to a group of Royal Marines to not only show his ability to play the character, but to also demonstrate how a Marine drill instructor breaks down individuality in new recruits. How tall are you, Private? Sir, five foot nine, sir! Five foot nine? I didn't know they stacked shit that high. From now on, you're Private Snowball. Do you like that name? Oh, yes, sir! Bullshit, it looks to me like the best part of you ran down to cracking your mama's ass and ended up as a brown stain on the mattress! As a director, Kubrick was known as a perfectionist and was not very fond of his actors ad-libbing their lines, but Arlie Ermey was able to fit into his roles so well because he drew on his true past experience as a drill instructor during the Vietnam War and actually improvised half of his dialogue from the script. But let's all be real for a moment. Who's going to tell this guy what he can and can't say? You will not laugh. You will not cry. You will learn by the numbers. I will teach you. Now get up. You're so ugly you could be a modern art masterpiece. Sir! Sir what? Are you about to call me an asshole? The director also uses this scene to highlight the characters Private Joker and Private Pyle and give the audience a glimpse into the importance they play in the plot of this movie with the attention they draw from drill instructor Hartman because of the mistakes they make. Hell, I like you. You can come over to my house and fuck my sister. <clears throat> you little scumbag! I got your name! I got your ass! Pal, I'm gonna give you three seconds. Exactly three fucking seconds to wipe that stupid looking grin off your face or I will gouge out your eyeballs and skull fuck you! This was one of the last movies Stanley Kubrick directed before he died and it's probably the best known film that he did and was nominated for an Academy Award. Arlie Ermey's performance was so profound that it won him a Golden Globe for Best Supporting Actor. So for anyone out there who hasn't seen this movie, I would recommend it for its excellent acting and for its accurate portrayal of the Marine Corps recruit training. Let us know how you feel in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe.